out as their quarterback with this offense to take over once more. He had the short touchdown pass on their previous drive. They'll try and start this drive in the air. And he steps out of bounds, but not before he gets inside the 35. A big play there on the keeper. 62 yards. Their entire offense has been centered on him, and he's been carrying the load with ease. 100 yards rushing in a game for a quarterback is rare. In a single half, darn near a masterpiece. After 1-7-0 on EA Sports. Flush to his right. But it's caught on the right side at Smith. And he will reach the five-yard line before going out of bounds. A very solid gain of 27. He'll look to throw. Toward the end zone, but that's going to wind up incomplete. A line of scrimmage once again, the five, as they get ready for second and goal. He'll look to throw, eluding the pressure right, locating OBJ out along the sideline. They get only a yard there, now it's third and goal. They'll drop to throw. And that's going to be caught for an Eagles touchdown. Grant Calcaterra from four yards out. And the Eagles have taken a two-touchdown lead now. I believe they buzzed down. They're going to take another look at this play with all review. After review of the play, rules on the field. So they called it a touchdown originally, and this will stay a touchdown after the video review. So they had it right. Now back to throw. They'll roll him out right. He'll let it go deep for Beckham. 
And a penalty flag comes in as that one winds up incomplete, but the contact is going to move the ball well downfield. Well, sometimes when you try to defend OBJ, you're going to get a P.I. call. He might get a P.I. call at just about any point during his route. And I think a lot of teams have taken the, the whole philosophy of, hey, just go and do what you have to do and hope eventually they'll quit calling it. But not in this case. They dropped the flag for the pass interference. Off the play fake. He'll look to throw. A hit as he throws there incomplete. I see the surprise in your face. up, not that time. They'll look to throw on third and goal. Touchdown, Eagles! Odell Beckham! Already his second touchdown here in this opening weekend. And the Eagles are looking good here in the season opener as they're able to extend their lead. So a good start to the campaign so far for them here in week one. Yeah, all the things that you dreamed about in April and May and that you worked on in July and August, getting ready for this game, it's all coming together so far. Their quarterback in this offense heading back out to the field. Out of the gun, they'll look to throw. He finds his target, Beckham. And he is out of bounds inside the 30. Second and five. Quick hitter here, it's complete. And he's going to be marked down just outside the 10. Let's just call it what it is. This has been a flat-out struggle for this defense all game long. They've really had a hard time slowing them down. And while I'm not big on speeches and guys jumping up and down, they might need their team leader on defense to get in their face right now and light a fire under these guys. They've got to start playing better assignment football and start getting guys on the ground. Now this offense in mid-season form here in the opener. It's first and ten. And that nearly a turnover, but it's incomplete. Well, fortunate to retain possession there, and it's second down. That certainly appeared to be a play call where they were just trying to make second down, second and short. I think they thought the coverage was off a little bit more than it was. Nice job there pressing up on it and forcing the incompletion. And that'll be incomplete. Took a pretty good shot as he tried to pull that one in. Couldn't hang on third down. So back-to-back -back incompletions, and that has him staring at a third and ten. And this is caught. Touchdown, Philadelphia. Odell Beckham. As the first half that they just gave up there, that's a tough one for their defense to swallow because they've had a tough time through the first two quarters. They really were determined to get a stop there, unable to do so. That makes their comeback hopes that much more difficult. And the Eagles ready to go on offense to begin this third quarter. And the first half definitely went their way, and this would seem to be a great opportunity to kind of put this game a little closer out of reach with a score here. Yeah, and it's a wonderful opportunity for them because if they can add seven more to their lead before the other guys even see the football, that could be the He's got a man complete. Touchdown, Philadelphia. Devontae Smith. 75 yards. And the Eagles come right out of the locker room and score here in the opening minute of the third quarter. And we didn't even get a chance to settle in for that drive. A quick strike of 75 yards, and they find the end zone. Don't you get the sense that film study was behind this one, that they saw something that they thought they could take advantage of? The key is...
Philadelphia getting set to take the field. throwing here to start the drive and he's got his favorite target yet again it's complete and he's taken down but able to slip across the 35 nice way to start the drive a gain of 12 and a first down and if anyone thinks they're just going to tuck their horns in and pull back off the throttle a little bit you can forget it even with this big third quarter lead i think this team's going to continue to take their shots downfield and there's another completion Line of scrimmage, the 37 on first and 10. Oh, now Beckham, 63 yards. And the Eagles are able to strike quickly to add on to their lead. And let's count them up now. One, two, three, four touchdown receptions for him in this game. And just one shy of the NFL record. What a great performance going up and catching the football, creating space, and finding the end zone. That's what it's all about. peek at the captain of this offense heading back out there and nobody in the stadium feels better than he does right now just a slew of touchdown passes he's been spe okay, throwing here to start to drive as they connect left side and he'll be taken down but not before they work it across midfield that one nearly 30 yards, 29 officially. Well, I certainly don't want to pile on, but this defense has just not been up to the challenge in this game, and this continues as we see here. Coverage, not been very good. Soft in spots. There's an easy throw and catch for another first down. Now a throw here, hauled in. And he goes down, but not before getting this inside the 25. One quarter remains here in this Thursday night matchup. We'll return with more after this. This is the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. together a pretty shaky start to the year for this defense as they defend another first and ten this is caught and he's brought down after a very nice game so three plays already first and goal and they are wasting little time now they'll throw here out of the gun and this will be caught and the carnage continues. It's another touchdown. We'll be heading into week two. This has been an impressive week one performance. They've certainly announced that they are ready to go, haven't they? They wanted to send a message out to the rest of the league. You better put your... Now this offense back out and set to go for their next drive. Looking to throw. And give him another six. It's caught for a touchdown. And the blowout continues. 
turning into a really good performance on the road week one you're just hoping for that first win it's tough to do it away from home though but they're looking strong it certainly is any road win in the nfl is a great road win i mean it just does not matter whether it's supposed to be tough or not in this particular situation how great will they feel leaving with a win on the road against a tough opponent a little work still to do though and we remember, of course, all scoring plays need to be verified upstairs. And I think they're going to at least take a look at this. They're taking a peek at whether or not those feet were in bounds. And obviously a big call here in the end zone. And not just the feet. How about the hands? How is the ball possessed while the feet are hopefully getting down in bounds? That's what they're trying to look at to see if it all comes together.
Now it looks like he'll throw here. Escaping the pressure right. Wide open receiver complete. 49. And now it looks like they're going to be in the hurry up. Now here's a throw that's complete. And the tackle going to be made at the 38. Back-to-back -back good plays have them on the move on first down. A give. Singletary right side. And he'll take this down to the 33. I feel like I could see what he was thinking on that carry. Wanted to follow that big tackle through the hole. Ended up only getting four yards on the carry. I think he had designs on that one being bigger. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. Singletary again. It's a five-yard game, but they'll still be a yard short here with third down now looming. I really like the vision he displayed on that play because he saw there wasn't a lane to completely break off a huge gain, so he found where there was the most space and got what he could. A nice, dirty run that's a positive play for the offense. Oh, now look at this. They're lining up to add three more. A little insult to injury here late in the game. And this one is right down Broadway. And that will extend their lead even further. Well, partner, the season officially underway. It was great to be back with you, obviously. But the first game of the year, always a special one. And love, I know you do too, love having it on a Thursday night. Yeah, I think it makes it special, right? It makes it so that everyone is just watching, all eyes on it on a special night like that. I think it's going to be a great season, partner. Can't wait for the next several months. We know there are going to be surprises all the way through the season. And before we know it, we'll be talking about opening up on a Thursday night again next season. So for the Eagles, they start the season with a great win on the road here in the Thursday opener. And now they'll have a few extra days here before they face the Giants next week. Meanwhile, for the Panthers, they go down to defeat here in the opener. And they'll try to get back on the beam next week as they'll head to Tampa 